Hello Star Munchers, Max here, back playing Bioshock 2. We're rocking and rolling right into the next episode. We managed to clear a lot of this area. We have killed both of the big daddies in the area that had little sisters that we needed to rescue. So now it's just a matter of looting the heck out of everything over here. Um, what are... I am not on the right ability here. Yeah, please die. Thank you. We need to loot this area. There is a big daddy in the area, but not one that we need to be worried about. Oh, a cure-all, huh? Sure. This place would have been nice if I had come in here earlier. Um... Uh, hold on. No? Okay. I guess we're just supposed to crawl through. Okay, there's the gene bank. So we can't purchase more gene slots from here, right? I don't think we can. Uh, let's just grab as much stuff as we can from here before we move on. Here, let's... Listen to this bad boy. Eventually, they give themselves over. Like dying is an honor. I'd almost feel sorry for them if they didn't have my daughter. I'm going to find Lamb and take Cindy back one way or another. So, hmm. What would be crazy is if Cindy was Eleanor. And that's like her actual father. That would be wild. Okay. Okay, so. Can you die, sir? Thank you. I'm gonna have to figure out how to get up there anyways. Oh, that's stupid. Okay, I need to buy, excuse me, sir. I need to buy the hack stuff if they have it. They probably don't even have it over here. Okay, we have to hack it in order to get it. Hold on. Okay, cool. I will take both of those, okay. So that means, wait a minute. You can research on dead enemies. So it does work, it just doesn't give you as much. All right, I'll take it. Thank you. Man, you guys, I did not miss the turrets. I can tell you that much. They are just as annoying. All right, uh, let's go shotgun, keep the electric ability out. All right, let's go upstairs, because I think there's some bad guys hiding up here. Um, so Gracie, Aunt Gracie. So she was staying with Grace Holloway, which is why she would feel d more deeply betrayed, I guess. Die. Thank you. Ooh, that's fun. Somebody name a 
whales are starting up worship services down in Siren Alley, if you believe it or not. All faiths and creeds welcome, they says. They got big promises, salvation, immortality, a way out of here. I don't care how crazy it sounds, a way out of raptures, music to my ears. Next Sunday morning, I'll be there. There's one of those big goons now. Start your camera rolling on him, and then let him have it. I'll consider it. I'm not currently ready to do that because I don't have supplies. Um, Firestorm. Um, set your foes on fire when they strike. Hmm. Uh, uh, I might store that in the gene bank for now until I can unlock more slots. Just want to quickly loot as much as I can up here. Um, we got 120 bucks. So that means I should probably go buy some more stuff before I do this. Thank you for your contribution. Never mind, you don't have anything. All right. All right, I guess we're going for it. Okay, so do we want fire or I guess that worked a little bit to like shave off some health early on. Is it back this way? This doesn't look familiar. Um... Alright, so big surprise, they were wanting to smear campaign to get rid of Lamb, which that checks out. I need to save, because it has been a minute. Um, so yeah, something, clearly all of this happened in the past, because Ryan is now dead, but how did Ryan come to power if people were rocking with Sophia Lamb's vision, so to speak? It would have had to have been some sort of a smear campaign of some sort. Ooh, that actually worked Look very well. You, sport, a regular junior shuttlebug. And it appears you've picked up a new trick from that big galoot. Now get back to the Sinclair Deluxe and just bust through that mess blocking your way. Oh. Uh, shift click to do a drill dash. I don't know if I did that right. Wait a minute, wait a minute. This is Eleanor's stuff, right? Here, father. It's yours. You are evolving fast, but your heart is getting weaker. I can keep you alive, but you must find me. Uh, stored plasmids can be re-equipped. You can buy more plasmid slots with Adam at a gatherer's garden. Okay, store that in the gene bank. So hypnotize, huh? So we can do that from a gatherer's garden. This one's broken. Oh, hi. Sorry to break up the vibes in here. Yikes. All 
Alright, let's get out of here. We will be reborn. Yes, you mentioned that before. Ooh, weapon upgrade. Um, Machine gun we don't have. I'm going to go damage increase on the shotgun. Uh, what do we got here? Closing the limbo room. What happened? That's it. We have to close down the limbo. Bomb goes off in that fancy place uptown and everybody panics. Pulls their money out of the banks. A whole city tugging on the same dollar bill. So the banks fold. And maybe one in ten got their savings out. <sighs> Who's gonna come here me nightingaling about how broke they are? How am I gonna provide for little Eleanor? All right, we need to get to a gatherer's garden pronto so we can get a new ability set up because it has been a minute and that was one of my problems with the first game, not like an issue with the gameplay itself, just a dumb thing that I did poorly. Okay, where's the nearest gatherer's garden from here? Is it like back a long ways? Uh, should we backtrack to gatherer's garden? Whoa. Hi. You suck. Wait a minute, is the stuff cleared? Can you guys not? Goodness. I was supposed to shift click my way through all that and I backtracked and now I don't even know if I can do it anymore. Or no, wait, this is... No, this is right. I guess we'll just go to the next gatherer's garden we come to. This is the one, I think. Just rev up that drill of yours and slam right through that pile of junk blocking your way. Woo. Okay, I don't want to be using the heavy stuff just yet. Now, Gracie was on the top floor. Get on up there and persuade her to give you that override key. Baby snatcher, huh? So she must have been in your care when whoever turned her into a little sister did what she did. I'm assuming that was like Ryan, maybe? I don't know. What do I know? Um. I will take any of the hack stuff I can possibly get my hands on. Because that is going to help me immensely. Um, as far as I know. Okay, I'm for close quarters. There's probably going to be a lot of loot around here. It also sounds like there's a big daddy walking around. Which is not great. But I will take all the supplies I can because it's probably giving them to me for a very specific purpose. That being, uh, if and when I end up coming face to face with, um, Gracie Holloway, who I'm assuming is going to throw everything she's got to try and kill me. Because she thinks that I stole Eleanor for some reason. So, we're going to do our best. I don't know if Delta is capable of speech. 
what would be crazy oh what if i'm the dad that came down there looking for cindy and that's an old tape like i left them and they were doing an experiment on like an actual father-daughter bond like what that would do power level wise i don't know that's just a wild theory i'm sure other people have thought the same thing oh no i hate it here i hate this so much Ah, oh, okay. Um, is there anywhere else I can explore up top or up around here on this level? Nope, I don't think so. It's just that long, awful hallway, which I am not stoked about at all. I hate this a lot, actually. I mean, I can see that there's bad people over here. All right, I'm getting the shotgun out for this. I there, There's nothing for it. It's shotgun or nothing. You all better stay corpses. Ew. All right, well, let's just walk into this nightmare. Sorry, not sorry. What did you get for sneaking up on me? <sighs> Nothing good in there. Okay. This music is terrifying, so that's good. Don't you do it. Stay down, please. Anything back here? Oh, gosh. Oh, hi. I mean, I, I saw you. The baby snatcher's headed up into the hotel family. He wants me so he can get to Eleanor. Tin Daddy feels no guilt. Tin Daddy feels no pain. But we are the family, and we can teach him how. Well, I drank something I shouldn't have just then. I saw a dude run. Yikes. Um. All right, where am I going? You're gonna get up, aren't you? Wait a minute. No, I already went through here. Can I drill through this? And that hallway does not get any less creepy, does it? Okay, yeah, that's what we gotta do. We gotta go through this. So, left click, shift. Nope. Hmm, okay. Oh, this giant obvious way, maybe? Probably that. Ooh, gun upgrade? I mean, hi. So how do I get back there, huh? Oh, the door opens. There's still another way? Oh, oh no, oh no. Is there's a runny dude? You gonna stop running? <laughs> oh, that doesn't get old. All right, are you guys done giving me the, the run around? You done being stupid and annoying? We done? I would love it if you guys would just stay dead, please. All right, this way is where the room was, I think. It's all right, I should have known better. Need to be better about looking before I leap. You hurt 
shouldn't give me such a lift. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Be quiet for a second. Um, uh, dynamo's power to incoming projectiles will be reflected back at attackers while the drill is spinning. That is interesting, but I'm going to go clip size for the ri rivet gun. Not as clean on the inside as the doctor. I'll take my jaw where I can. Yikes. Yeah, you are lost. Yeah, I'm not very fond of y'all's family. Not to be mean, but you guys kind of suck. Whoop. Thank you. I will take that support. Okay. Let's go regular rounds on that. I need to actually, like, think through what I'm doing here. Oh. Freezing drill. Okay. Store that in the gene bank. Oh, because the atom, everybody's like transfused with. Ooh. Yeah. Cool. Don't care. Cool story. Some slob shacked up here buys a box of syringe parts from me for twice what it's worth. He assembles them in his rat hole, and I buy back the finished product for a dime against the dollar that I'll get from Ryan. Profit coming, profit going. Old Andy rambles on about the great chain. I got people shelling out to pull it for me. Yeah, I mean, Sinclair's, he's a scumbag. Like... The game is doubling down on that and making sure that I know that. But I already kind of figured that out, you know? He doesn't seem like a good dude. All right, we got remote hack stuff, which is good. All right, so I think we need to go down the obvious hallway, probably. I am real bad at getting sidetracked. This sort of stuff. I get turned around very easily. Ooh. Photos? Andrew Ryan told me that in Rapture, it didn't matter where you came from. Bunk. Times got hard, and all our old bigotries bubbled right back up. But Dr. Lamb showed us that down under the skin, down under the money, down under our very name, we are family. Yeah, well, look at... It, it, it clearly went great for you guys. Clearly. That scared me. Hey, dude. Come this way. Thank you. I walked past the safe earlier, didn't I? I think I did. I don't know where it is, and I don't want to go back for it. It's not that important. Probably. Yoo-hoo. Over here. Come on. Come on in, pal. It's a nice area, nice house. You could just stroll on in. I'm stripping you for fun. Got to play it smart. You're no fun. All right. Let's grab this. Almost went past it. 
not to speak up against Mr. Ryan's policies, and now he's missing. Just never came home. I went by the bookstore, and all his books are gone, too. I don't know what to do. Now I have to deal with that awful Sinclair just to have a roof over my head. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Sinclair's not good. We, yes. That has been thoroughly emphasized. Alright. So I can come back if I need supplies here in a second. If I burn through a bunch of shotgun ammo real quick. Any volunteers? That seems unsafe. Oh, are you kidding me? Root Splicer. You guys are... Whew, you're something else. Alright. Well, that happened. Lots of butterflies. Very pretty. I was also advised to make sure that I loot everything. Okay, so the butterfly theme is... Okay, let's learn more about the butterfly theme already. doesn't spin a cocoon. It just grows armor on the inside before the change. It is us. To wear a butterfly is to support Dr. Lamb and the family. Before long, Rapture will split wide and take wing. Imago is coming. Imago is coming. That's what was on the wall. Gracie's room is just up ahead. Now, she's been sending all manner of unkindness your way, so I'm not particular as to how you take that key away from her, but she's old, and this grudge against you was based on a misunderstanding. Whoa, Sinclair, you actually care whether or not I kill her? Good for you, I guess. I'm going to save real quick before this happens, just in case... Something irrevocable happens. I I don't know what's gonna happen. Cause I don't wanna I don't wanna kill her, but she's clearly gonna be a problem. So Imago is coming. The image is coming? We're getting some Latin stuff going on, I believe. So the image is coming. We both died tonight, monster. I, because your kind has killing in its nature. And you, because there's no way the family will let you stroll out alive with that key. Okay, cool. Okay, so this is where Eleanor was. And Eleanor is a genius, first of all. So this has probably been a long time, huh? It's been a long time. Yeah. We got a lot of stuff we got to sort through in the next couple episodes as far as, like, our stats. I'm sure Grace Holloway was like a, a wonderful surrogate mom, like, versus Mrs. Lamb, like. Empty house. Only an echo to my name. Eleanor. Baby, where are you? I turned my back and someone took you. It happened so quick. I'm not even a half mama to you, girl. I couldn't protect you. 
This poster of Dr. Lamb in my room is staring me down like it knows I'm ashamed. I've always been loyal to your real mother, Eleanor. Always trusted her with my secrets. But I lost you. What will the doctor think of me now? She failed you. Like, she set you up for failure. And whoever stole Eleanor away, that was not your fault. Gonna get jump scared? I know what you're here for. Go on, take it. I won't have you touching me. Dr. Lamb trusted me to care for her child. And I tried. But baby Eleanor disappeared. And then one day, I see her walking with you. Looking wrong. And when I tried to hold her, you knocked me down. Broke my jaw. So I'm ready, baby snatcher. Come on in and finish the job. That is not what I came here to do, ma'am. I'm sorry, but clearly I can't, like, talk to you. Your call, friend. Grace is unarmed, for what it's worth. I'm not, I'm not gonna do nothing. You just calm yourself. I'm just gonna look around real quick. Don't mind me. Just looking around. What are you doing? Come on, you goddamn monster. Do what you always do. Come on. Bye. <laughs> to hell with you then. Come on. Ta-ta. You're a bigger man than I am, Chief. Maybe next time she'll think twice about pointing fingers before all the facts are in. Now, let's be on our way. Eleanor's waiting. Man. You had me under a gun, yet you just walk away? No monster alive turns the other cheek. No monster does that. A thinking man does that. Uh-huh. I know that Dr. Lamb is no liar, but she's got to be wrong about you. Doesn't seem right now, letting you walk into that bushwhack waiting outside. I can't call off the family, but I can whisper a bit and improve your odds. These whirlybirds are custom jobs by an old friend. I'm afraid this is all I can do for now. That's all right. We'll take that. I will gladly take that. No use hiding. I know this estate like the back of my hand. And to be fair, like she was only operating off of what she was told. Like, I don't hate Grace Holloway for being wrong about that. One night in a warm, clean bed. Is that too much to ask? Bye. That's what you get for tampering. Okay. Uh, drill fuel? I think we're good. Wait. Yes, I think we're good there. Um, auto hack darts. Yeah. Bye. Oh, the shotgun is glorious. So long, chum. Bye. Oh, playing as Delta is so much fun. For Grace, the paradise of Andrew Ryan was most unkind. She spoke against him in song, and he had her blacklisted. It left her penniless. But in the family, she has found hope, a reason to draw breath. Ask yourself, Delta, do you deserve to take it from her? Oh, great. OK. 
Okay, two hits and I'm dead. Got it. Noted. Wait a sec, am I walking away from where that guy is? Because I, I do want to kill that guy. Mark my words, I intend to. Yeah, here we go. Well, sir, I don't know what to call you now. You've done more than just spare my life. You've opened my eyes. I need to put a few questions to Dr. Lamb. Don't bother, because she'll just kill you. Alright, where is this? Palooka. Wait, is that you? How did you die up here? Did you hit a big daddy? How did you die? I don't know. Alright, guess we're done here. Oh wait, Gather's Garden. We need to buy a slot ASAP before I forget. Okay, health upgrade, that would be nice. Hold on, plasmid slot, yes. Um, gene tonic slot. Health upgrade, Eve upgrade. Plasmid slot again, why not? Gene tonic slot again. Cool. Um, you don't have Eve, so I'm good. Um, I'm probably gonna call it there, I think. We got quite a bit done, more than I thought we would. And I'm pretty satisfied with how we handled the situation. Um, could have gone way worse. I am glad that the game gives you choices in certain things, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know what kind of a person you'd have to be to walk into that room and just absolutely murk Grace. By sparing Grace, do you seek to gain my trust? A feeble ruse. Your crocodile tears may poison her with doubt, but I am not so easy a mark. Cool. Um... Yeah, I guess we'll move on. Just take that override key and slot it into the control box in the ticket booth there. That'll open the gates. Yeah, we'll do that next time. I'm going to call the episode there. So thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye. Head back to the train station, sport.